All right, what's up, Hot Squad? Welcome back to my Hot Banger Recap Marathon. We're going to check out Cool 109's Godzilla, the new Empire recap. Yes, that's right. Another freaking recap. I've been doing these brand recaps for Godzilla as come for, you know, for different YouTubers. And I love it so far. I love it. So this one's called That Time Godzilla King Kong Squashed the Beef Just Crashed Out on Scar King Shima. Long ass title, by the way. Long title. But good lord, yes. Um, yes, I've seen a bunch of recaps. Godzilla as come, so I, need what's I know what's going on. So without further ado, Hot Squad, what's the time? We're going to check out Uno 9's recap of guys at X Kong, the new empire right now. Let's check it out. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, get it, get it, get it, get it. So after Godzilla beat the goofy out of him, he said, Hey, little bro, you cannot come to Earth ever again. If <laughs> you do, I'm going to have to rip your whole entire spine out. <laughs> so, bro, just been chilling in the hollow of Earth this whole time. His ass do not want that work from Godzilla ever again. <laughs> Man, if y'all thought I was going to take it easy on Kong this movie, oh, hell no. Nah. I'm going to be on my freezer tip this whole video. <laughs> So Kong on Hollow Earth trying to get his ass some vittles. Over here leading all these big ass dogs into this trap. Kong <laughs> ran all the way to the edge of the cliff. One of these dogs tried to press Kong yep. and they just fell into this big ass pit with spikes. Ugly as hell. And that man Kong pulled the lever dropping all these rocks on these other dogs. But Kong was not finished because he picked up one of these dog carcasses and ripped it open above his head staring Ooh. away all the other animals. And now look at bro, filthy, dirty, yucky boy gotta go take a shower. <laughs> and I ain't gonna lie, I know that shower right now hitting. Yeah. Kong's ass goes and eat breakfast and he swears he just heard another monkey making noise. He's like, my people? Bro, he heard his people, but it just turned out to be some frog. And I'm not gonna lie, if I was Kong, I would have blew that video. <laughs> I'm not gonna spoil my emotions like that, big dog. But forget about that, hey, we on to the... God, Godzilla just since niggas was trying to mess with his hmm. turf. He got this big ass crab monster named Scylla just tearing up Rome. Hmm. Big Zilla sees bro messing up Rome and we know Godzilla don't even really care about Rome. It's the principle <laughs> that he is on his turf and Godzilla and Scylla see each other. They run full force and Godzilla is bro with that mean ass shoulder bash. Bro wasn't done. He said, I want crab legs for dinner. Grip bro up by his leg and started spinning his ass around. Knocking <laughs> little bro into this building. But Zilla was not done because he ran at bro. Jumped up in the air. Stomped on his chest, I guess. I don't know how crabs work. Held little bro's arms down while Zilla was still fighting for his life. Using <laughs> his little tentacles to try to do something to Godzilla's mouth. I don't know what Silla freak ass was trying to do with Godzilla's <laughs> mouth. Godzilla like, oh, he wanted to kiss all right and shot the yep. Baja Blast Ooh. directly into man's mouth. Damn. Turned his ass <laughs> into goop. Fast forward a bit, and that man Kong has pulled back up in the surface, bro. His tooth started to hurt a little bit. This somebody's goat, by the way. <laughs> he had to play doctor for Kong. Gave little bro a root canal. But while he's back up there, they come to the realization that some crazy stuff's about to happen in Hollow Earth. So once Kong leaves the Hollow Earth, they follow after. And my man Godzilla over here just absorbing power plant after power plant, getting that Yao Mina ready. And all I got to say is, if I see Godzilla and he's just doing some random activities, bro, I'm going to just let him be. Yeah. I don't care if I'm military, it's my job to protect this facility. Godzilla said he wanted it, bro. He got it. That's his for real. I'm not finna stop, bro. He goes back <laughs> to Kong and Hollow Earth, and his ass also feel a disturbance in the force. He goes and picks up his axe, and just like a Minecraft map, his ass starts exploring <laughs> the parts of Hollow Earth he ain't never been to before. Kong basically goes through a portal, and now his ass is in the subterranean rail of Hollow Earth, and would you look at that? It's Dewey from Malcolm in the Middle. <laughs> Damn. Turn my boy into a monkey, man. <laughs> Malcolm in the Middle used to be my man. He's his favorite show. His ass can't watch it no more, I bet. <laughs> Kong. Bro, my gonna remember was one of my favorite shows growing up, man. Wow. His ass over here trying to be nice to Dewey. He reached out to little bro and Dewey just bit his <laughs> finger. Hit the dash. And now this grown ass man, King Kong, chasing after this little ass kid, Dewey. And Dewey, <laughs> Dewey. leading his ass into a trap. Cause Kong gets pulled up on by a bunch of other apes. And oh hell nah, this nigga bald. Bald. But bald. Kong's ass gets stuck and pinned on the ground. Bro drops his axe too. And that balding ape was finna smack Kong upside the head with this oversized ass bone. But bro found a rock on the ground. Knox wanted to do his arm with the rock while the other ape was putting Kong in his headlock. Mr. Ball nigga was getting ready to swing and Kong turned to the side a little bit, having bro take out his own mans. Then he hit him in the back, knocking him off the ground, and that AP hit with the rock earlier pulled up with this bone. And Kong carried the blow and then threw his ass onto another monkey. 
bald nigga pulled up with Kong's axe and he just smacked his ass away like he wasn't nothing. <laughs> here come Dewey, bitch ass. He jumped <laughs> on Kong's face like a cat, starts scratching it, bro. But yeah, Kong says. picks bro up by the He's leg. a weapon, too. Bro, what do you think this nigga does, bro? <laughs> he starts using his ass as a pair of nunchucks. Yeah. Kong, maybe Boop. I was too harsh on you. I didn't know you were bald. But Kong finishes off by kicking bald nigga in the chest, and then his ass throws Dewey directly at his head like a damn toupee. He said, cover that shit up. I don't want to see it no more. What? That forever be one of my favorite parts of the movie, though. One of the apes get back up, but it don't matter. Kong puts his ass right to the ground again. As he hammer fists, bro, right hmm. in the back of the head. And that's a crazy place to hammer fist somebody. I'm pretty sure bro is dead. And I don't know why he's so mad at bro right here in particular, because he was finna pick him up and do something crazy to him, but his homeboy over here saved his lifeless body by jumping on top of Kong. But Kong threw his ass off of him, damn near dropped his ass off the cliff, but Kong said, we both monkeys. We should not be fighting. <laughs> monkey on monkey violence is crazy. <laughs> so he helps his ass back up on this cliff. And somewhere, Uncle Ruckus and Frieza is saying some of the most racist stereotypes known to man. Because immediately after Kong to help bro back up on this cliff, he reached for the knife and tried to boom the nigga that just yeah. saved his life. And what did Kong do? His ass parried the knife attack and then he took Dummy. him off of this cliff. And that scared off the other bald-headed monkey. His ass started dipping, but Kong said, nah, nah, nah. I got something for that ass. <laughs> yep. He just lobbed his rock and hit bro directly on the knob. I ain't gonna lie, bro got an arm on him. Mm -hmm. Kong finds Dewey and throws his ass on the ground, starts screaming at him, calling him a badass little kid. And Kong tells him to take him to where the other monkeys are. And Dewey does just that. So now Kong think Dewey leading him to the other apes, but really Dewey just leading bro into another trap. Dewey let this man Kong into this big ass body of water, and it was fake playing in it, waiting for the sea titan there to sneak Kong. Huh? And then once it does, oh, that yep. man Dewey hits the jets. Yep. And I know in his head that man Dewey was ecstatic. He was probably like, got that dumb stupid ass <laughs> nigga. But three seconds later, an axe comes flying at Dewey's yep. head. And so does that Titan's head. Ice Kong just walks behind little bro like, the hell did you think that that was going to do to me? <laughs> and his ass starts walking away with his corpse, getting ready to eat up on him. And Dewey reluctantly follows. Then he sees Kong grubbing down on him like, God damn, if only I wasn't stupid, my ass could be eating right now. <laughs> so Kong gives Dewey a piece and this nigga became a dad in three minutes, man. This mm -hmm. is crazy. But that's enough monkey business for a little bit. <laughs> now we're on to the god. Yep. This man Godzilla pulled up on Tiamat and saw her little ice cube and just started blasting that hole open. He said, run me them hands now. <laughs> Tiamat comes outside and she just starts wrapping herself around Kong. This ain't done to my boy though, because he just took a big ass chunk out of their neck. Tiamat was like, oh, you gonna bite me? And tried to bite Kong back. And oh, <laughs> nah, this was their worst mistake. Because they wrapped their little gilly thing around Kong's face like a mask. Yep. And Kong just started letting that yapper spray. Quite literally slicing and dicing their ass. Turned Tiamat's ass into seafood. Yep. After Godzilla beat the brakes off of Tiamat. He goes into their lair and he just starts chilling in there, absorbing all that energy. We go after Kong and Dewey and they finally get to where all the giant apes are and I know Kong ass ecstatic. He's like, look at all these niggas. <laughs> they my niggas. <laughs> Kong is over here walking, taking in all of his surroundings while we see all these other apes working, moving rocks. And then one of them drops a rock and they start getting bullied. And Kong don't like that. He helps Lil Bro up, and then that ape that just kicked his ass down starts talking crazy yep. to Bro. Like, why is nigga moving his jaw so much? He don't speak a lick of any language. But Kong hit that boy with the one hitter quitter. He said, get your stinky ass breath out my face now. Oh. And then we see him. The Scar King. And hold on yep. a second. This nigga got a little bit of aura, bro. I ain't gonna lie. He kind of got that shit on for real. Just peek the stance and tell me bro ain't hard. His ass <laughs> jumps down to come meet Kong and all the other apes start bowing down in his presence. Yeah, this nigga got it. I ain't even gonna <laughs> lie. But Kong ten toes down. These boys trying to have an aura off right now. 
And this is actually crazy as hell. He pulls up on Kong, puts his whole finger in his mouth, looking at bro's platinum tooth. <laughs> and then his ass start laughing, having the other monkey laugh at Kong too. And Kong don't give a damn. Bro was stone faced the whole time. But <laughs> it's crazy as hell. He just let a whole other man put his finger in his mouth and he ain't do nothing about it. Even Dewey laughing at Kong right now. And Scar King pulls up on little bro, looks at him and says, Ain't shit funny, little nigga. <laughs> and another one of the apes tries to protect Dewey. And Scar King, like, ah. Right. I'll let it slide this time, but he sees that Kong was worried about Dewey, and he don't do nothing to Dewey directly, except kick the ape that was protecting his ass into some lava. Oh, nah, this an evil-ass nigga for real. So Kong gotta spin back for his jet. So Scar King pulls off the weapon that he had wrapped around him, and he starts spinning that hoe around. He tries to attack Kong. Kong dodges the first strike, and then he grabs the doohickey. But Scar just he yanks it away from Kong, cutting his hand. Kong sees his own blood. He starts going ballistic. He runs it, bro, full speed. Goes to the overhead with his axe, but Scar King flips out the way. He weaves another <laughs> axe strike just to parry the third one and then damn near disarm Kong of the axe. As his ass jumped to the side of Kong, hit him right in the shoulder with his knife jam. Mm. And Kong is pissed. He tried to lob <laughs> that nigga head off with his <laughs> axe. But Scar King dodged and hit this backflip kick right on Kong's jaw, dropping his ass down to the ground. He then disarmed Kong of his axe, jumped on top of him and started choking his ass out with his weapon. And his ass was laughing the whole time he was squabbling with Kong. I ain't gonna lie, bro. He went in the aura off right now. But Kong flipped Scar King off of him. Then he picked his ass up just to slam him on the ground again. Damn. Scar King like, ah, ah, damn. <laughs> that kind of hurt it. And then these two apes pull up trying to help Scar King. But he's like, nah, nah, nah. But I got this. As he pulls out his dagger, it starts to glow. Kong starts looking behind him. And oh, yep, nah, Chimo. that man, Scar King, got an albino Godzilla. Mm -hmm. Something about this situation is funny, and I won't say it. <laughs> but albino Godzilla's name is Shimo, and they got ice abilities. I'm talking about anywhere they walk, <laughs> it just starts to freeze over. And I know after Shimo pulled up, that boy Kong was getting that Godzilla PTSD. <laughs> but Shimo starts shooting these ice beams <laughs> at Kong. He dodged the first one. Kong thinks Shimo shooting the same beam Godzilla was shooting in their first fight. So he tried to absorb the beam with his axe. And the only thing he did was freeze that nigga's hands. Boy got frostbite like crazy. And Scar King over here telling him, hey, finish this nigga now. As Shimo's getting ready to ice age this nigga, Dewey pulls up with the clutch, <laughs> pointing out an exit point for Kong to get out of. And then the Scar King sent a bunch of the apes to go after Kong. All I'm saying is, if Godzilla was down there, he would have been putting up prime time LeBron numbers. Kong escapes the great. Um, the actor who played Doom Malcolm in the Middle, I'm not so sure he's retired, but I haven't seen him in a while. Dave's making his ass look like Albert <coughs> Einstein compared to the rest of these niggas tripping <laughs> his ass out. That man Kong pulls up to where the human were on Hollow Earth, and he pulls up with his owie. They see that bro got frostbite all over his hand, and you know what they do to bro? They give his ass electrified brass knuckles, man. Yeah. As Scar King over here marching for war on top of Shima with all of his apes. But we go back to the god and oh yeah, <laughs> this nigga just went Super Saiyan yep. Rose, man. Who else doing it like my goat for real? But after Kong got that new arm put on him, he's like, damn, them boys Scar King and Shimo on my ass. Better call Godzilla or my ass is finished. <laughs> so he goes back to regular Earth and that boy Godzilla sinks. <laughs> yeah. There's some bullshit on foot. Yeah, and seriously. One, as soon as Kong stepped foot back on Earth, that man Godzilla started swimming to Egypt. He said, little homie, you finna run me that fade now. Yes. But once Godzilla gets close enough, King Kong tries to calm him down. Like, wait, no, I don't. I don't want no problem, bro. Please, bro, please. <laughs> I need your help, but Godzilla not trying to hear none of that BS Kong <laughs> spewing. And Godzilla just spears this boy <clears throat> Kong through a whole damn hero. <clears throat> Godzilla was still on that ass though as he was sprinting at Kong some more, but bro just threw some pocket sand in Zilla and started hitting the jet. He do not want any of those problems. Man, look at how easily these boys are just breaking these pyramids, bro. I know the Egyptians that work hard and long on those looking down in heaven like, ain't no way they ruined my hard work this easy. But Kong then hems Godzilla up on this pyramid and gets his ass with suplex. Yeah. Kurt Angle. 
Godzilla was finna stomp his ass out, but Kong dodged out the way and hit him with his sick and nasty ass uppercut, dropping Godzilla on the ground. Oh, nah. I ain't gonna lie, this is tough for me to even cover, because Kong just started pounding away at this nigga Godzilla. Now my boy out there looking goofy. He's gonna burn a hole through that nigga chest, but Kong just chopped him nope. right, laying his ass out. And he proceeded to violate even further, bro. He started dragging my goat by his tail. Put him down. <laughs> but Zilla ain't going out like no bitch. He started charging that yep. Yao Meaner up from the tail to the head up. And Kong let go. He looked at Zilla. And that's the face of a man that realized he's about to get a nuke shot at his chest. <laughs> Kong starts hitting the dash as Godzilla lets that Yao Meaner spray. This nigga Kong must think he playing Elden Ring or something because his ass rolled out of the way. Now there's dust everywhere. He don't even know where Godzilla is. And all I got to say is how do you lose a nigga that big? Like how he not hear his footsteps because that nigga Godzilla was right behind him. And Godzilla headbutt Kong right in the chest having him fall to the ground. He then started applying that pressure, put his foot right on bro's chest, started pressuring his ass down as he started charging up that Yao Meter one more time. But out of nowhere with this save comes Martha, her ass really says some damn. <laughs> and I know that he's a Godzilla happy and he's like, oh hell yeah, my shorty back. Mothra over here whispering sweet nothings in the Zilla over here telling bro, hey, you gotta work with Kong. And good coochie make a man do anything, man. <laughs> Godzilla was just gonna shoot the nigga head off. Now we finna work with him all cause of sure he said so. So now Godzilla and Kong pull up to Hollow Earth to get rid of Scar King. And just look at this duo. Day is giving off prime time Shaq and Kobe right now. Yep. And I remember watching this scene in the trailer and being like, Scar King got smoke for Godzilla and Kong at the same time? Surely he's not like that for real, for real. And this nigga Scar King over here riding Shimo like a damn horse. Yeah, Kong saw that and was like, man, I'm gonna do that too. And he hopped on Godzilla's back. And I know every fiber in Zilla body is telling him to power <laughs> bomb Kong off of him. The only reason he's not doing it is because he shorty told him to get along. But everybody was finna clash at each other. Scar and Kong, Shimo and Zilla. And then these two pieces hit, changing the gravity, making everybody start floating. My main man Zilla don't care. He said squabbles is forever. He started jumping from rock to rock, piecing up these giant apes just to get to Shimo. That's my dope for real. Zilla tackles Shimo and then kicks yeah. their ass damn near all the way down to the ground. Star King over here going from rock to rock trying to kill Kong. He tries to attack Kong with his own axe, but he blocked it with his metal arm. He then started swinging that thing at Kong. But Kong also blocked that with his metal arm. But Scar King said, where your bitch ass going? Turn him to Scorpion. Pulled that nigga towards him just to kick him right in the mouth. The humans over here trying to escape, but the giant apes on their ass too. But Mothra over here running the greatest supporter of all time. Maybe sure they can get up out of there. Kong got this nasty ass two-piece off on Scar. Then his ass started getting jumped by Monkey. But little Go Dewey came in with the assist, threw a goddamn rocket mm. We go back to Zilla yep. and Shimo. This nigga Zilla don't care about nothing. He don't care about deflecting or getting out the way of the beam. He says, I want your head on a platter today. His ass do get frozen a little bit, but Mothra said, not my nigga. Mothra <laughs> hit Shimo with this shockwave, knocking the ice cubes around this nigga brain. And that gave Zilla enough time to break out of the ice, and he just tackled the mess out of Shimo. Kong and Scar over here squabbling, trying to get the axe, but the crystal hit one more time, turning the gravity back off. Scar sees the portal to actual Earth. He's like, oh, hell yeah. He starts hard focusing on that. But Scar King and Shimo pull up on Earth, and they get to work immediately. They start freezing the whole planet. Scar King got Shimo working triple-double overtime. While Kong just pulls up, knocks his bitch ass the hell out. And Zilla over here. Let's make a side ring. And oh, nah, that man King Kong got down one of Scar's teeth. Wow. But yep. now we here, man. Godzilla and Kong versus Shimo and Scar. And I'm going to tell you this right now, man. This the fight where Scar King lost all of his aura. But Godzilla <laughs> does what he does best. And he starts tackling the mess out of Shimo. As this monkey-ass nigga Scar King just starts swinging around these buildings until he gets drop kicked in the chest. His ass then starts ordering Shimo around. Kong was finna go for this axe handle off the top rope. Which is a crazy move. I'm not even going <laughs> to lie to you. But Shimo smacked that nigga away with their tail. Kong starts looking at the people in this building concerned. And I want y'all to remember this by the way. Shimo came to finish off 
off Kong, but Zilla said, nigga, there's no way you're forgetting about me as <laughs> he snuck the mess out of bro. Bit they neck, dropping him on the ground. But Shimo threw Zilla off of him. This man, Scar King, then wraps his whip knife around the building, <laughs> breaks off the top piece, and throws it at Kong. Oof. And then King Kong just punches the building into oblivion, nigga. There were still probably people in there. <laughs> what I seen earlier about you looking inside that building and seeing <laughs> that there was humans in there and Karen. That's crazy. Not even 30 seconds later, you just start killing people. But Scar and <laughs> Shimo start tag teaming Kong. Scar hits this nasty ass kick on Kong, knocking him <laughs> back. But Shimo grabbed that arm with their mouths, started slamming bro into building after building after building until they were done with his ass. Mm. But Shimo was not done because they started shooting a ice beam at Kong. He didn't have enough time to dodge, so he started blocking the blast with his metal arm. And this nigga Scar King just in the back laughing. <laughs> God, so he was like, oh, I bet I got some for that ass. He starts charging up that Yao Meaner. He was about to blow the Scar King's back out, but he dodged out the way just in time. <laughs> then he tried to throw his whip at Kong, and he caught it with his mouth. And Scar King, he was over there getting beat the fuck up by Kong. You do not want any problems with Zilla, my nope. guy. No, nope. he throws that man. Then he breaks the yeah. whip, dropping the crystal that was controlling Shimo. And Scar King's like, whoa, hold on, wait a minute. Just not let that happen. So he starts hard focusing on getting the crystal while Zilla's still trying to blow his back out with that Yao Mina. Scar yeah. King is dodging. His ass got nicked up a little bit. <clears throat> he recovered fast as hell. Then his ass gripped up the crystal. His ass dropped it again because Godzilla was finna get a headshot with that Yao huh? Mina. And Kong in the cut still getting his arm almost frozen off until Godzilla's like, I came here to shoot somebody or something. <laughs> he started beaming down Shimo. Bit that nigga on the neck again. So now Kong tries to go for the crystal. But Scar King's like, I cannot let that slide. His ass starts choking the life out of Kong. But you know who comes and saves the day? Do Big we? dude. Yes. Pulled up to regular Earth. The hammer. That's my little big goat for you. Yes. I know that got my nigga Scar King pressed. Because he gripped up Dewey and was finna start doing this nigga deviously. I know he was finna punk that nigga like a damn football. But Kong yes. and the new father was like, bro, like he and I kicked my kid and just punched the mess out of Scar King. Oof. And Scar King don't know, but the next 15 seconds of his life finna be the worst 15 seconds of his life. Because he's finna get jumped like crazy. Because Kong picked up Scar King, lobbed his ass to Zilla. Zilla then proceeded to hit that nigga with his tail Ooh. back to Kong. Kong caught Scar, started choking his ass out. And Shimo's like, damn, wait a minute. I'm I'm free. I'm free again. I can go home and Godzilla starts hard pressed. He's like, bro, you finna start shooting that nigga. So like, oh, oh, my, my bad. And Shimo starts beaming that man, Scar King down with their ice, freezing his ass. And you know what his ass does after that? He slams this frozen ass oh. nigga onto yep. the ground. Starts punching the carcass, and now there's nothing left of Scar King. Bro is dead as <laughs> hell. Godzilla unfreezes the sky, and that's really the end of the movie. Kong, Shimo, and Dewey go back to Hollow Earth. Godzilla's still chilling on Earth. But more of the story is, I don't care who you are and how many people you got with you. You do not have enough smoke for Godzilla <laughs> and a King Kong duo. Kong where Godzilla beat the brakes off of Superman. He was not seeing them too. Damn. But other than that, man. Wait, Wait Superman fought Godzilla? Are you kidding me? I'm going to get up out of here. If you like, like, comment, subscribe. Do all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, I'm out of here. Bye. All right. Oh, by the way, my freaking camera cut off because somehow the charger I got from my camera freaking didn't work. And it kind of interrupted my reaction. Really freaking sucked. But overall, I got it down pat. I actually got it down pat, baby. So yeah, Hot Squad. Like I said, it's another guys. I as I recap, of course, I did a bunch of these before. But hey, look, it's nice to see people's presence on this. So Hot Squad, that is my conclusion of my Hot Banger recap of Godzilla as Kong by Cool Uno Nine. By the way, this is from last week and. This week, I have more coming, by the way. And also, I'm finally off tomorrow. That's right. Tomorrow's Friday, y'all. So I'm off for the entire weekend. I'm going to do this week's recaps and trailers tomorrow. So I'm going to get it down pat this week. So yes, I'm finally free, y'all. So yes, Hot Squad. If you enjoyed my reaction to Cool Order 9's recap of Godzilla as Kong, please hit up on the your thoughts. Have you seen that? And 
What's your favorite movie in the MonsterVerse? And are you excited to see the next Godzilla XCOM movie? So, Hot Squad, I have finally, finally now time for Hot Banger trailers I wanted to get to starting right here, right now. So, Monday, Paramount dropped the official trailer of Santa Hedgehog 3, which, by the way, that's gonna be my first trailer I'm gonna react to in a few moments. So, Hot Squad, please stay tuned for my Hot Banger trailer marathon. <laughs> 